Thank you for joining us tonight. First at 10, a week after they left their home without a trace, the Cerigliano family of four from Nuego County was found safe in Wisconsin today. Fox 17's Marisa Oberly joins us live in the newsroom with this update. Marisa? Megan, it's still unclear how police found the Cerigliano family, but officials say they got in touch with them Sunday morning in a city more than 400 miles away from Fremont. Capitalized and bolded, Fremont police got their message across on Sunday. In a release, Chief Tim Rodwell said around 11 a.m. the department safely located the Sirigliano family in Stevens Point, Wisconsin, a small city two hours northwest of Milwaukee. I just keep praying. It's the outcome so many people in West Michigan wanted after investigators asked for the public's help earlier this week. According to police, Anthony, Suzette and their sons, 19 year old Brandon and 15 year old Noah disappeared last Sunday, hours after Anthony made a bizarre call to 911. It is related to September 11th and people want to erase me from the face of the earth. Police say they left behind a family member with dementia who requires full-time care along with their pets. Throughout the investigation, officials obtained security camera footage which showed the Ceriglianos at a gas station in the UP on Monday. They then stayed in Iron Mountain for a few days. It's unknown why the family went there. The department says the family still fears for their safety, but the elements of the investigation do not meet the criteria for protective custody. With the investigation now closed, they thanked everyone who stepped in to help. And we left numerous voicemails and emails with Fremont police to get some better answers about the circumstances surrounding the discovery of the Ceriglianos, but we have not heard back at this time. A relative at the family's house that we spoke to this afternoon declined to comment about the situation. As for that family member who was left behind, we're told that they are now being cared for by other relatives. Reporting in the newsroom, Marisa Overly, Fox 17 News.